A couple times during the movie, I thought you ducked out on me. I had to use the bathroom. Well, at crucial times like these, you should inform a girl about having a small bladder. It saves her from abandonment fantasies. Would it help at all if I told you I didn't sit down to pee? In this theater, I don't sit down to pee. Going dancing? Maybe. I'm not asking to go with you, you know. We can take this slowly. Joan, this isn't anything. It's not anything now, and it won't be anything ever. Wow. Message received. End of date. I'll walk you to your car. Oh, that's so sweet. That is so sweet. He never wants to see her again, but he doesn't want her to be dismembered in the underground parking. Where are you parked? On the artist formerly known as Prince Level. Which one is yours? VW in Space 23. Uh, th there's nothing in Space 23. Really? Maybe you're on the Rolling Stones level. No! The Madonna level? I wouldn't be caught dead on the Madonna level. Well, call the police. I'm sure they'll be able to find you. I can't believe this! My parents bought me that car. Joan, don't... What? Don't what? Don't cry. I don't f***ing cry. It's something of a thing with me. Very nice. It's a hole. But it suits me and Blanche just then. Speaking of Blanche. <laughs> Jesus! Why you scared her? That's the ugliest cat I've ever seen. She's an angel. She only has one eye. Yeah, but it's a good one. Get on, on Blanche. That mean man won't hurt you. Um, I should I should be going. I can make coffee. I don't drink coffee. He doesn't drink coffee. Team? I don't want to. You don't want to be mean. Go ahead. You're terrific. Sensational, really, but I, I'm not right for you. Wow. You should write these kiss-offs down. They'd be, they'd be perfect for a chapter called Piercing the Heart in exactly ten words. That was ten words, wasn't it? You're terrific, sensational, really, but I'm not right for you. Yep. I can't say any more except for that. I, I'm, I'm sorry. And, um, and goodbye. Goodbye or good night? <sighs> goodbye. Good night. Bye. Oh, you know, you did it all perfectly. Now I'll pick up the car tomorrow. No, you won't be meeting him. It didn't work out. Oh, well, how should I put this? He's virtually non compass mentis. Any resemblance between any real person, living or dead, is purely coincidental. Uh, you want more? Well, the lad doesn't say much, and when he does, he finds just the right words to crush my soul. Of course, I'm crazy about it.